I actually have a couple multi-dimensional approach and different things I want to talk about. One is about responsibility as a man. Mm-hmm. Um, and not from my perspective, because I think people who follow me know where I stand on freedom, being a man, responsibility, leadership, leadership, yeah. discipline, all that shit like that. I'm talking about from a woman's point of view. And, and what's cool about doing this with you, with us, is we get to bring the approach of, well, let's be honest, our demographic, the people we speak to are severed, broken for the most part, right? There's other podcasts out there. People are they're lying, most of them, but talk about how great their life is and any problems. Well, the truth is we've never really had any problems, but that's because we fucking have worked on it day in and day out. Every for, single day. For, right. Mm-hmm. The, the, the conversation I want to bring up today was actually going to kind of lead into both those. One, responsibility as a man, right? Because you've been married before and you had someone else. This isn't a knock on anybody else. Just the real truth of facts of a man being a fucking man. We're going to talk about mailing in some of the responsibilities, but the other one is, um, you, like we said about never having a fight, keeping the spark alive. Yep. Like I believe that the honeymoon phase is bullshit. Yep. And you've said that since day one. I don't know where, where that, where were we? Cause we don't use that term, but I, I remember you speaking to me saying the honeymoon, the honeymoon phase is bullshit. And then you went to like this big tangent yeah, per it, usual, but <laughs> I just think that I think that it's fucking stupid. Like I don't understand how anything can be a honeymoon phase. If you make a commitment, this will go hand in hand. I want you to talk about you're married to me. You dated me. Um, you've overcome a lot of things. You heard a lot of shit about me before we came here. You've witnessed the growth as a man, right? The metamorphosis of Mark Jennison. You, mm. You've been able to witness from a guy who was climbing out of a proverbial fiery pit of hell to ultimately leading thousands and thousands of men to their, their destinies and their futures. Um, but in, in between there, you've been part of a lot of different things, right? And you've watched the responsibility, how it keeps getting fucking put on me more and more and more and more as we go. But we talk about this honeymoon phase. Most dudes, why this is going to go hand in hand when I wrap this up together is because people fucking get into a relationship, in my opinion, or, or they have a wife where it sounded good. They went in, but they never wanted to do any fucking work. Sure. Right. They never wanted to do. I would work. agree with that. And, Impartial. And, and it's not even the fact that I don't feel like we do a ton of work, but we do a lot of work because it's the fabric and the DNA of the relationship that yes, we built. Exactly.